Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So this is a special one. Not only will I be showing you guys the brass Trivax contour, but it's also my second birthday. That's right, my second birthday here on YouTube. But I'm sure the TV screen behind me already gave that away. That's right, it's only been two years, but it seems like 10. And going back and watching my first video, I've come a long way. Welcome back everybody. Today I'm gonna to be testing out six soda gadgets. Let's see what they're all about. Yeah, let's move on. So some of you already know, to celebrate my second anniversary on this channel, I have a second Trayvax Contour and Brass to give away. So stay tuned to the end of this video to find out how you can win this bad boy right here, still in the box. So this is basically the third video I'm making on the Trayvax Contour. So this will not be a full in-depth review. If you wanna see the full in-depth review I did on the Trayvax Contour, I'll put some links below in my description box. So go check out that review, go check out my video on the Trayvax Contour Titanium. And then of course, this one right here is the Contour in brass. So this is the brass Trayvax Contour and the leather color is Mississippi Mud. So if this isn't another review on the Trayvax Contour, what is it? Well, I have my two other contours right here. I'm just going to basically show you these side by side, weigh them, show you the differences. So this is my original Trayvax contour. This is the raw steel version and the leather is steel gray. So this version right here, I just have a love for. Check out the raw steel color on the frame and then the gray CNC stainless steel plate that covers it. It's just absolutely beautiful. And I love this steel gray color on the leather. And since this is my first Trayvax contour, I had it engraved with the channel name. And of course you guys can get that done too with whatever name you want. And then of course the titanium Trayvax contour with tobacco brown leather. Now I did do a review on this titanium contour a few months back and I actually gave one away. If you guys want to see that video, I'll put a link in my description box below as well. But the reason you guys are here is to check out the titanium contour and brass. Now why do I think this wallet is important? Well, with the current world health situation, I think everybody knows right now brass has antimicrobial properties. Meaning if any germs get on this brass portion, it can only live from two to four hours. And I've even read in some cases, even less than that. So check this out on the bottom here, we have this super nice brass frame. But if we turn it around, we have this CNC stainless steel plate that covers the top. And on the brass version, it's black. So why do I think this brass version is important? Well, I just did a video on the COVID key. It's a brass hand extender that you can push buttons with, open doors, uh, touch touch screens. And being brass, it's antimicrobial. All the germs will die between two and four hours. Well, I started looking at this contour and I'm like, this little piece right here where the lanyard loop is, this almost looks like a little finger. So if you're one of the many people out there that don't carry a brass key, well, if you have this, it's already in your pocket. So say, for example, you work in a building with an elevator. Well, you take out your brass contour, this little piece right here, push the button, there you go, you don't have to touch it with your fingers. And it can work for anything else, a keypad at the store, those push button hand dryers in a bathroom, those push lever paper towel dispensers you see in bathrooms. I think this is a perfect little hand extender made of brass right at the end of your wallet. But unfortunately, it just doesn't work on touch screens. So while I was at the grocery store picking up food, I decided to check this out and see if it worked. And as you can see here, the button presses just didn't register. The surface area of this lanyard loop here just isn't big enough. And then right here, I wanted to demonstrate this on my Nest door lock. As you can see here, it did register as I pressed the yell button, but right after that, I couldn't get it to work again. I tried pressing that yell button again. It wouldn't work on the keypad. It just wouldn't work. But to be fair, when I reviewed the COVID key, it had the same exact results. And even though it's not ideal, it semi works on a door handle. You can see here, it took a little fidgeting around, but I eventually got it. So in a pinch, if you don't have gloves, tissue paper, you have this in your pocket, yeah, it's better than nothing. All right, let's weigh this bad boy. This, of course, is the brass version. Let's plop it on there. Looks like it weighs 2.6 ounces, and in grams, that is 74 grams. So now let's try the raw stainless steel version. Hey, that's 2.6 ounces as well, so that's 74 grams, exactly the same as the brass. So now let's try the titanium, and this is gonna be a lot lighter. 
So that's 56 grams, and 56 grams in ounces is exactly two ounces. So as to be expected, the titanium is gonna be a little bit lighter than the raw stainless steel or the brass. And now that I have three of the four leather choices, let's check them out. So on this contour, this is the steel gray leather, so we can get a nice look at that. And then on the titanium version, this is the tobacco brown. And then if I hold these together and bring in the Mississippi mud, you can see the differences with those leathers. Now, the only color that I don't have is stealth black, but I'm pretty sure we all know what that looks like. Now, if you guys watch my video on the titanium contour, you know that it's become my EDC wallet. But since receiving this brass version, I actually put the titanium away just because I absolutely love the look of this brass on this wallet. Check out the brass with the Mississippi mud color. It is absolutely beautiful. So if you guys were wondering, this brass version is my EDC wallet. Just taking one look at this brass and I fell in love with it. All right, so let's put these to the side here and this is the giveaway wallet. So let me open this up real quick so you guys can get a nice look at this brand new Trayvax Contour in brass. And yes, guys, it is exactly the same as my EDC wallet. It is a brass contour with Mississippi mud leather. So how do you guys win this? Well, it's pretty easy. Number one, you have to be subscribed to this channel. Number two, you have to like this video. And number three, you just have to comment on this video. I don't care what it is, it just has to be a comment. Now my last contour giveaway was a titanium contour and I only required 100 comments to give it away. Yeah, I basically hit that in one hour. So I have to up that a little bit. So at 300 comments, I give this bad boy away. And a lot of you have asked where I announce the winners. Well, it's in my community section. Go to my homepage under the community section and it shows you every single winner of all the wallets that I gave away. So let's run through that again. Be subscribed, like this video, comment on this video after 300 comments. This could be yours. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. What do you guys think of the Trayvax Contour in brass? So if you go to their website, if you wanna pick up the raw stainless steel version contour, it's $139.99. If you wanna pick up the one in black, it's $149.99. And then it shows right here, the titanium contour is sold out, but the brass model is completely gone. So the last time I saw the brass model on their website was about a month ago. So I'm not exactly sure why it's gone. I'm not sure if they even offer it anymore. But from what I'm seeing here, if you guys wanna get a contour in brass, the only way to get it is right here in this giveaway. And yes, Trayvax did send this over to me to review, but that's why I have this guy to give away to you. Unfortunately, I only have one to give away, but if you still want a contour, I do have a special code for you guys. That's right, put in code CT10, you can get 10% off your entire order through the Trayvax website. So remember code CT10 if you guys wanna get 10% off your next order. And I will have all that information down below in my description box. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please give me that thumbs up, please subscribe, and go!